A ball check valve is a valve that normally allows fluid, liquid, or gas to flow through it in only one direction, which using a ball as a movable part to block the flow. The one on the right is a simple ball check valve made from scraps and reusing an old computer mouse ball. Considering the size of the ball, 22 mm in diameter, therefore it only applies to half inch, 22 mm, or 3 quarters inch, 26 mm, PVC pipe fittings. The ball is made of steel ball covered with rubber, so it sinks in the water, blocking the hole, and this is the default position. This is how it works. In the initial state, there's only a pressure above the ball and the weight of the ball that caused the ball to block the PVC valve socket hole as the inlet. So the fluid pressure from the inlet must be greater than those two to lift the ball and unblock the hole. When the fluid pressure from the inlet is greater than the air pressure above the ball and the weight of the ball, the ball lifts up and stops at the stopper above it and the fluid flows up through the pipe. When the fluid pressure from inlet is equal to or less than fluid pressure above the ball and the weight of the ball, the ball returns to its default position, blocking the hole and the fluid stops flowing. In this case the greater pressure of the fluid above also pushes the ball to block the hole quicker and tighter. Even when the fluid has been drained from the bottom inlet, in other words there's no pressure from the inlet below, the ball still blocks the hole even more tighter with the help of the fluid pressure above it. So that's all how it works. This is the exploded view of the ball check valve. It consists of six elements, including the mouse ball. These two parts can be bought at the hardware store. The first from the top is PVC faucet socket, and the other is PVC valve socket. Both of them use three quarters inch in size, but there are two different size for the pipe threads, half inch and three quarters inch. But these three parts must be made by ourselves. Okay then, let's get started. This footage is proof that the mouse ball can actually cover the inlet well and hold the fluid on it without leaking. First step is the measurement of the material. The outer diameter of the connecting pipe is 26 mm. And the diameter of the mouse ball is 22 mm. The second step is designing the pattern in CAD software. And this is the result. The first one from the left is the pattern for outer surface of the connecting pipe and the rest too the pattern for the ball stopper. Finally, here are all the materials needed, including printed pattern. This is the process of attaching the pattern to the radial surface of the connecting pipe using glue stick. And this one is the process of attaching the patterns to the flat surface. Now is the process of cutting the material according to the pattern. It's going to be a little tedious. How about a little music?
after the cutting process is complete, it's time to clean the pattern from the material. Okay, let's check whether these components can be paired according to the design. Well done! In the design, there's a certain depth limit between the connecting pipe and the PVC valve socket. This is to ensure the bolt can move up and down inside. For this reason, a mark on the connection pipe surface is required as the pipe depth limit. Please focus on this stage, this is the most important process. Installation of connecting pipe and PVC sockets using PVC glue. It takes speed to keep up with time before the glue cued. And it also takes precision to get everything in place as in the design. Check the results of the installation again. Make sure that the ball can still move up and down in the pipe by shaking and feeling the ball moving inside. The last step, plug the PVC faucet socket to the rest of connection pipe thoroughly. And this is the end result. A simple, cheap, and well-functioning do-it-yourself PVC ball check valve for under 50 cents. Be sure to check out other videos on our channel. Thank you for watching.